What's up my luxurious bestie? Welcome back. Today is all about the Zarena Summer 2023 Luxury Curated Everyday Outfits. My name is Kiretta and on my channel I save you guys time by finding the newest fashion pieces and how to style them in an elevated and luxurious way for everyday occasions. Let's jump right into it. We have no time to waste. I went through everything that they had for their summer 2023 collection. Fall 2023 is out as well so keep an eye out for that video. A lot of these sizes are currently sold out but if you guys click the notify me for later I am sure you will get notified and you will be able to get this piece hopefully sooner than later. First top is the white Eliza the top. It is $219. It is 100% cotton which is really great. Cotton and gauze are like the perfect fabrics if you are someone who is easy to sweat. I am very easy to sweat so I love anything that gives me a nice airflow and lets my body heat come out. So it says to turn it inside out. Machine wash cold, thank goodness. One less thing to take to the dry cleaners. Gentle cycle and hang dry. The model is 5'9 and she's wearing a size small. This top is really cute. I love simple, airy, lightweight tops that have like a minimal look and it can have some kind of a design to it so it's not just like plain boring like a basic piece. It's definitely a step above having just like your everyday essential wardrobe. I would wear these definitely with the shorts she's wearing. I'd probably also do jeans like a high-waisted jean or a low-waisted jean. How you accessorize is really what is going to make the look. I probably wouldn't wear blue shorts. I'd probably do like some kind of a cream gauzy short something like that and whether you're a gold or a silver jewelry person i probably would go gold with this one i'm just seeing like some nice chunky bracelets with it um maybe a statement earring or like a smaller stud kind of an earring and then um some kind of like light not too showy gold necklace as well for shoes, I would probably do some kind of like really nice flat sandal. But if you want to do like a different kind of casual shoe, you could just do like some kind of cute sneaker. I would probably go white. I would wear this white Eliza top probably just, you know, everyday basis. I can see myself going to run errands in this, shopping, really anything honestly, just like out and about around the house. You could wear this to a lunch, like a super casual lunch with your friends, with your sister, that's what I would do. You can definitely wear it to work as well. So next we're gonna go into the Rose Mellow Channing shirt. This top is 175. They have it in a bunch of different colors. The rose is gonna be the summer color, but they have a bunch of other colors that I feel like would also be really cute. Like the skylight blue is really pretty and the cream peach is really cute too. This top is also 100% cotton. Jean wash cold, gentle cycle, tumble dry low. So nice, you can stick it in the dry. Dryer. Of course, if you guys want these pieces to last longer, I recommend to hang dry. I try to hang dry as much of my expensive, like, Zerena kind of pieces as possible. I feel like it also helps retain the color, so I just try to make sure that I hang dry as much as possible. The fit is true to size. The model is 5'7 and a half. Very specific measurement. So for this one, the back's really cute. I would definitely leave it tucked out. So I would probably leave one front half tucked out so i would unbutton it until that like middle part where her belly button is where the high rise jean is show is ending and i would tuck one side out tuck one side in i would tuck one side in and leave the other side tucked out and i'm really seeing some kind of like rich chocolate leather belt with this definitely i would go gold jewelry just like really cute a goldies or levi's or something and then i would either do a nice brown leather sandal or i would do some kind of pointed pump next we have the skylight riley shirt this top is 196 it comes in a couple different colors i really like the color skylight bit of like a shorter kind of button down traditional button down which I like because I don't always want to have like a super oversized button down I feel like this is a nice kind of in between I would have worn jeans that are just a little bit tighter than this picture I feel like it's kind of giving a little bit too much of the um, boyfriend look I probably would I would still definitely do a high-rise jean I'm really in this gold jewelry phase right now but intertwine you can swap between I would honestly do silver or gold jewelry it just kind of depends on my mood for that day 100% cotton machine wash cold gentle cycle and tumble dry on low so another great one again I probably wouldn't put it in the dryer so you know you do as you please but your clothes to last longer just do it you know the 
longer way a little tip is of course wash it on cold uh dry it on low heat you can also put your shirt inside out inside of a laundry bag that you can stick in the washer and dryer that way you're preventing it from getting tangled up in a bunch of other clothes and giving it that really hard crinkly look that can be really really tough to get out even with steaming and ironing depending on the piece and that can also prevent your clothes from getting burned when it's being pushed against the back of the dryer where it gets the most hot for a long period of time it can tend to get that burn so that can also be preventative for that as well as getting any buttons pulled off your you know washer and dryer likes to do a bunch of different things i've also have started to get like laundry stains on a lot of my like my bedding my clothes laundry bags is something that can also add an extra protective layer where it doesn't immediately get on that piece and it soaks it right up it still will wash it nicely and thoroughly but just a couple of tips if it's true to size model is 5'9 and she's wearing a size small and i would totally do this i probably wouldn't do like medium wash jeans i'd probably do like super light wash jeans or a darker or black jean just like a super lightweight cotton tank top underneath it you can also probably get away with doing a bandeau it just kind of depends on how see-through it really is in person right next on the list is the white gianna top this is one of my favorite tops from the summer 2023 collection I would get this top in white. I would probably also get it in the skylight. And I personally do not like the way that purple looks on me. I just don't really like the color purple. But I think that this is a really pretty color for anyone else who looks really good in purple or loves the color purple. It is 100% cotton. Wash cold, gentle cycle, tumble on low. It looks really good with gray pants. So I like the green that she's wearing. I personally don't like that shade of green, but I think it looks good. This gives me an idea that I can wear it with different color pants and it doesn't have to be a traditional light wash, medium, dark wash. I would wear this top on an everyday basis. It definitely gives me also vacation vibes. So I would either put this as a, you know, cover up on my top or I would wear this on day two or day three. More of a the relaxing or going to lunch or something like that. Next, we have the white Kennedy dress. This one is 345. We have it in black and white. I would probably wear it in the white. Uh, the black is actually really cute too. I would definitely get it in black as well. If I had to pick one, I would pick white. The dress is 100% cotton. Sheen wash cold, gentle cycle, low, dry, and it's hang to dry. If it's true to size, the model is 5'9 and a half and she's wearing a size small. So this dress is super cute. I would wear this at night, dress it up a little bit more. I would definitely take this dress to any kind of like tropical vacation as well and wear it as a dress that I can wear out. And I would wear it you know, just during the day, uh, going to lunch, I would also wear it to dinner and just add a little bit more accessories to style it up a little bit. Next, we have the Cinder Rose Pippa dress, and it is in the color Cinder Rose. They also have it in white. I'm kind of torn in between the two. I really liked the rose color, and now that I'm looking at the white, I'm starting to like that one a lot as well. So I would get both of them. I would wear both of them to any kind of travel destination. And just every day for here, now that we're in summer. I'm trying to add some more color to my collection. I wore nothing but white, black, tan, and grays over winter. And it was a really long winter, so I am excited to bring out these pops of colors. It is 100% linen. Machine wash cold, gentle cycle, tumble dry low. If it's true to size, model is 5'9 and a half and she's wearing a size small. This dress is 335. I feel like this is also a really cute dress like if you're going to some kind of like day party, um, you know, like some kind of you guys are like poolside or you are going to a party that is in your friend's backyard and you're meeting a bunch of people and there's brunch and stuff so things like that next is the papaya skyla dress this one is 350 dollars they have it in papaya they also have it in the color petunia i would get it in both colors i would start with papaya i used to never wear anything orange and i've started kind of wearing those colors and honestly they they look so good. I love this color. I'm very excited to see this color palette. So this dress is such a nice material. It's 70% cotton, 30% silk. If you guys are a sweater and you like wearing silk, the way to go is make sure that you're getting something that's actually silk and not satin. Satin doesn't really let your body get rid of that heat and that sweat. It kind of holds it in causing you to sweat even more silk is breathable and it will let airflow come through and allow your body to release that heat for the care you're going to want to hand wash it cold and hang to dry 
The model is 5'9 and a half, and she wears a size small. Next up is the Hush Pink Tove dress. This one is 275. It is 100% cotton, machine wash cold, gentle cycle, dry, tumble on low. The back is so cute on this dress, I love it. Fits true to size. The model is 5'9", wearing a size small. So this one, another vacation dress. I would wear this out and about, running errands, uh, brunch, dinner, appetizers. I would say this is an all-around dress. In hush pink and in white, I would definitely get it in hush pink. I would get white as well if I really wanted to get like two. I feel like hush pink is light enough. Hush pink would be my number one. I'd also get it in black, actually. I would definitely get this dress in black. Next up, we have the Primrose Pink Emma dress. This one is, this one runs 210. They have it in a couple of different colors. This is such a great everyday dress. Like, I would say this is my number one dress that they've come out with. I'm obsessed with it. I would totally take it on vacations. I would wear it back at home. I would wear it all the time. 100% cotton, machine wash cold, gentle cycle, tumble on dry low. This dress is just so cute. I am obsessed with it. Better, like I would get it in this pink color and they also have it in cream or in creme. So nice. Oh my gosh, I can't pick between the two. I would get both of them. This is like, if I had this dress right now, I would be wearing it all the time. This dress would be sick of me. Super cute. I love it. Okay, if you guys shop Zarena, you know that the bow shirts are a must-have. You definitely should be stocking up on these colors, all of the basic colors. They are featuring the white bow shirt. Cute. Um, I also really like the cream peach. I mean, there's a bunch of different colors. You can't go wrong with it. And I would probably do jeans with them as well. Just add your statement jewelry pieces and this is an everyday look. If I was to take this white bow shirt traveling, I would use them kind of like, I throw it on, I leave everything unbuttoned and I would take it with me like as a cover up to the beach or um, just kind of walking around and put some other kind of like nice cotton t-shirt underneath. It's 100% cotton, machine wash cold, gentle cycle, dry on low heat. If it's true to size, the model is 5'9 and she's wearing a size small. Next up, you guys, I saw this set and I'm like, this is it. I Like, I would eat, sleep, breathe everything nonstop, 24-7, 25-8 in this set. This is the Cinder Rose Atticus Pant. It's 248. They have it in Cinder Rose. They also have it in the color Winds, which is that, like, creme kind of color. And they have it in black. I honestly would have to get these in every color. First would be the Cinder Rose, second would be that wind color. It's 100% linen, machine wash cold, gentle cycle, dry on low heat. If it's true to size, the model is 5'9", she's wearing a size small. The inseam is 30 inches. I am 5'1", so if any of these pants don't ever fit me, I would just go get them hemmed. Like, I know they're pricey, but I'm, I'm not gonna find these like high quality pieces in my size. So I don't have a problem with it. I'll just go get it hemmed. So we made it to the end of the list with the Cinder Rose Kyra top. It is 100% linen and so cute. For its care, you want a machine wash cold, gentle cycle, dry tumble low. If it's true to size, model is 5'9", and she's wearing a size small. But this outfit right here is like, like I love it. Barbie world. I would wear this all the time. They have the top in different colors. I really wish that they had it in the cream color. Zarina, y'all really should have made this one in the cream color. We could have paired it with those pants, but they also have it in dusty blue. I would get it in dusty blue as well. They have it in white. White is a no-brainer. It's an everyday essential. I would totally get it in white. And in the black as well. The black is really cute too. I would start off with Cinder Rose and then slowly make my way around, but I would get every single color in this top. That's how cute it is. Like, I love it. Well, that is the end of the pieces that I picked out for the Zarena Summer 2023 collection. I would wear that pink set everywhere. I would totally take that with me on a vacation, but super cute. I really love that Zarena makes pieces that you can literally wear for almost every single occasion. I would say maybe just like a couple of their tops may not be work appropriate and some, like some of their shorter dresses. You will find something there for everything and their stuff is such great high quality. 
I love the colors, I love the simplicity, but then the patterns and the textures and the designs that they add to it really is just such nice pieces done well. I told you my favorite pieces. I would love to hear your take on the collection and what you loved most about it. If you found this video valuable, please make sure to comment, like, share, and subscribe down below. Hit the notification bell button so that you are notified on all the videos that are uploaded. Make sure to subscribe and like this video to keep seeing valuable and high quality fashion content that you can integrate into your everyday lifestyle. I definitely want to hear from you. Leave a comment down below and tell me your favorite 2023 summer pieces from the Zarena 2023 Summer Collection. As always, love you my luxurious bestie and I will see you in the next video.